Today we're announcing, following the government's decision just uh, before Christmas, um, new legislation for reform of the electoral register. Um, traditionally, the local authorities have always been the bodies that were tasked with putting together the electoral register, and that will remain the case. However, the role of staff and local authorities has changed, and there aren't as many uh, uh, rent or rate collectors as there were before. So uh, we have an ambitious reform of how people register to vote. At present, there's 28 different uh, varieties of forms to be filled up if people are applying for the first time to go on the electoral register or to change address or looking for um, uh, a postal vote under some of the various categories that exist. So what we're proposing is a one standard form, both in hard copy and online, uh, that people will be able to use if they want to change, if they want to enter their details on the register, but also if they want to change and ensure that their details are correct on the register. Uh, it has been the case for the last number of years that there's a significant amount, hard to quantify, of duplication in the electoral register between different local authorities. So um, one of the key uh, aspects of this is the use of a unique identifier. In this case, it will be uh, the PPS number to ensure uh, that our electoral registers are accurate for all elections and electoral events uh, into the future.